Hey folks, JD here, and today I just wanted to take a couple of minutes of your time and talk about something that I think is a real game changer in the world of resin printing. Uh, <laughs> essentially, if you don't know, uh, when you when you resin print, obviously you need to have a little reservoir full of full of resin. Then a little printhead comes down, UV light then cures, makes the shape of whatever it is that you're 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 making, cures it directly onto the print bed, and that's essentially the process. There's a couple of big things with that. Now, it doesn't matter whether you're using industrial size resin machines or if you're using home style resin machines like the little red one in the corner there. Um, you're going to come across one factor, one factor that I couldn't get away from, something that really annoyed me, something, uh, and, and that was essentially the resin smell. Uh, now, it, it's not overpowering, it's a little bit strong, it tends to linger, it's a bit thick, you could almost chew on it, um, and it, it, it's something that really sort of annoyed me. Uh, it didn't detract that much from printing resin, because I've been printing resin and then painting, and, you know, resin prints really do stand out as being just superb absolutely superb and it's because of the superb print quality that you you carry on doing it so a couple of weeks ago i was on amazon i was doing a christmas shopping and i thought to myself i, I saw some elegoo water washable photopolymer resin essentially this one and um link is in the description if you haven't seen it um and it's 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 very difficult to get hold of at the minute it's pretty new i don't think it's been out that long from what i can see C come on stay and um I and essentially, it, it's a game changer. It really is. Now, now, um, basically, you you add it. There's a, a little niff in the air. That's it. And 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 there's nothing. When you when your print finishes and you let it drip, that's fine. You take the the UV the UV cover off. There's again a little bit of an odor, but it is a tiny bit of an odor. And with the windows open and with this air purifier, literally, it gets ca carried away within seconds. There's no thick air. There's no need to wear breathing apparatus such as that. There is there, there is none of it. Uh, it quite literally, all the smell just gets carried away. The best bit then, or the bit I know that all of you are interested in, is what is it like when it cures? Well, I made this little guy. I modelled this little guy. This is my first set of nine demons that I'm making. And uh, this little guy was made using that uh, photopolymer water water washable resin. There's no uh, IPA used in this at all. It is all washed in, in water and then cured through the standard UV curing process. Uh, and it took, to cure, to, to wash it took four minutes, five minutes. To cure it then probably about 80 seconds. It's not a very large model. It's not hollow either. It is... It is. Uh, I, I did print it as one great big large ball, um, and to be to be fair, I'm extremely happy with with the outcome. There's no whiting. There's no blotching. There's there's nothing at all. And the the resin has made all the features that I wanted stand out extremely well, including these tiny little spines on his on his on his branches. They really stand out well as well. I'm extremely happy with this. I've got a load more that I'm currently uh, I'm currently uh, printing off now. A load more of the demons that I've modelled and 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 I'm printing. They're up on Thingiverse. If you do want to print it for a bit of fun, you'll find the link to Thingiverse in the uh, in the description there. And um, yeah, so all in all, I'm very happy. To be to be fair, I've got a drawer there with a couple of kilograms of normal resin, and I'm honestly thinking about getting rid of the normal resin to just do this water washable one. Um, a couple more prints. Let's see how all these demons turn out, and then uh, once I've done all that, I might make the change to this water washable resin because why not that there is no at this point with the testing that i've done which is so far one and that one printed now there is no downside to doing it there's no lasting smell there's no heavy atmosphere uh it doesn't take ages to get the smell away it just literally as you open the as you open the window bang it's gone <laughs> and it's as easy as that the smell doesn't travel through your house there is for the, for the second, there is no reason for me not to keep on using this. I'm not sponsored by this. This is just my findings from printing. That that was my first one that I printed um, using standard resin. Uh, or even better, actually. Let me show you these. That's the one that I broke that I printed using standard resin. And I've just, I've just you know, uh, given him a, a gloss undercoat. But, um, and then the water washable one. If I put them two side by side, okay, maybe a bit difficult to see these. But there is no discernible difference, apart from obviously I snapped the arm. But in the the actual model quality and the resin quality, no, absolutely fantastic. Very very happy. Very very good. I think I'm going to keep on printing, see how it goes. I'll do a couple of updates, to let you know anyway. But um, 
yeah so far very very happy with it very very happy with it what do you think have you been using this water washable resin for a while i mean i i've just buying the elegu brand for the elegu printer that's literally it i'm not looking at any other brand for the second anyway i'm waffling let me know what you think let me know in the comments i think for the second it's a bit of a game changer anyway all right my friends thanks ever so much for watching and listening i've been jd you've been fantastic as always if you haven't already please like and subscribe and ring that bell too hello and welcome to all the new subscribers i hope you're enjoying the channel so until next time my friends Happy printing.